In the heart of a bustling metropolis stood a towering skyscraper, the headquarters of a renowned multinational corporation known simply as Horizon Dynamics. At the helm of this corporate empire was CEO, Alexander Grant, a man of sharp intellect and unyielding ambition. Alexander Grant was a visionary leader who believed in understanding every aspect of his company, from the boardroom to the factory floor. One day, he decided to embark on a clandestine mission, a social experiment that would challenge the perceptions and dedication of his employees. Determined to test the integrity and work ethic of his workforce, Alexander devised a plan. He would disguise himself as a humble employee and spend a week working alongside his staff, observing their behavior without them knowing his true identity. On a crisp Monday morning, dressed in a faded t-shirt, Alexander made his way to the Horizon Dynamics headquarters. He blended seamlessly into the bustling crowd of employees. Throughout the week, Alexander worked diligently alongside his colleagues, performing menial tasks and engaging in casual conversations. He observed how his employees interacted with one another, their dedication to their work, and their commitment to the company's values. As the week progressed, Alexander encountered various challenges and obstacles, from demanding deadlines to complex technical issues. However, he was impressed by the resilience and determination displayed by his fellow workers. Despite the pressures of their jobs, they remained focused and dedicated to their tasks. On the final day of his experiment, Alexander revealed his true identity to his astonished employees during a company-wide meeting. He commended them for their hard work and dedication, emphasizing the importance of teamwork and integrity within the company. The revelation sparked a wave of applause and admiration from the employees, who were both surprised and honored to have their CEO working alongside them. Alexander's experiment had not only reaffirmed his faith in his workforce but had also strengthened the bond between management and employees. From that day forward, Alexander Grant made it a point to regularly engage with his employees at all levels of the company. He understood that true leadership was not about sitting in an ivory tower but about being on the ground, shoulder to shoulder with those who made the company thrive. As the sun set on another day in the corporate world, Alexander Grant left the Horizon Dynamics headquarters with a newfound appreciation for the dedication and hard work of his employees. And though he may have returned to his corner office, his experience as a humble worker would forever shape his leadership style and the future of Horizon Dynamics. However, little did he know that another twist awaited him, one that would challenge everything he thought he knew about his company. As Alexander made his way home, his mind buzzed with thoughts of the past week. He reflected on the interactions he had with his employees, the challenges they faced, and the camaraderie that had developed among them. However, as Alexander settled into his office the next morning, he received an unexpected visitor. A young woman, dressed in a sharp business clothing, stood before him with a determined expression on her face. Mr. Grant, I need to speak with you urgently, she said, her voice tinged with urgency. Alexander regarded her curiously, gesturing for her to take a seat. Of course, please, have a seat. What seems to be the matter? The woman took a deep breath before speaking. My name is Emily Reynolds, and I'm a software engineer in the IT department. I've uncovered something troubling, something that I believe you need to know about. Intrigued, Alexander leaned forward, giving Emily his full attention. Go on Emily, what have you found? Emily hesitated for a moment before her revelation. I was conducting a routine audit of our systems when I stumbled upon evidence of internal misconduct. It appears that certain members of our upper management have been engaging in unethical practices, manipulating data to inflate profits and conceal financial discrepancies. Alexander's eyes widened in shock as Emily presented her findings. He felt a surge of disbelief and anger coursing through him. How could this be happening within his own company, under his very nose? Determined to get to the bottom of the situation, Alexander wasted no time in launching a full-scale investigation. He assembled a team of trusted advisors and legal experts, tasking them with uncovering the extent of the corruption and identifying those responsible. As the investigation unfolded, Alexander was confronted with the harsh reality of corporate greed and deception. He discovered a web of lies and deceit woven by individuals who had once been his closest confidants. As the investigation unfolded, Alexander was confronted with the harsh reality of corporate greed and deception. Despite the turmoil and uncertainty, Alexander remained resolute in his pursuit of justice. He vowed to hold those responsible accountable for their actions, no matter how high up the chain of command they may be. As news of the investigation spread throughout the company, morale hit an all-time low. Employees were shocked and dismayed by the betrayal of their leaders, 
questioning the integrity of the company they had dedicated their careers to. In the midst of the chaos, Alexander found himself faced with a difficult decision. Should he disclose the full extent of the corruption to the public, risking irreparable damage to the company's reputation? Or should he handle the matter discreetly, minimizing the fallout but potentially compromising his commitment to transparency and accountability? For days, Alexander wrestled with his conscience, weighing the consequences of each choice. In the end, he chose to prioritize honesty and integrity above all else. He made the bold decision to publicly address the findings of the investigation, acknowledging the wrongdoing and outlining the steps being taken to rectify the situation. The announcement sent shockwaves throughout the business world, but Alexander stood firm in his conviction. He knew that true leadership required courage and honesty, even in the face of adversity. As the investigation into internal misconduct at Horizon Dynamics unfolded, Alexander Grant found himself facing not only the challenge of rooting out corruption but also the daunting task of rebuilding trust within the company and among its stakeholders. In the wake of the scandal, employees grappled with feelings of betrayal and uncertainty. Many questioned whether they could continue to believe in the company's values and mission. Alexander knew that he needed to act decisively to restore faith in Horizon Dynamics and reassure both employees and investors that the company was committed to ethical conduct and accountability. One of the first steps he took was to establish an independent ethics committee comprised of respected industry experts and representatives from within the company. This committee was tasked with overseeing compliance efforts, investigating reports of misconduct, and ensuring that Horizon Dynamics adhered to the highest ethical standards in all its operations. Additionally, Alexander launched a comprehensive training and education program for employees at all levels of the organization. These programs focused on ethics, integrity, and corporate responsibility, empowering employees to recognize and address ethical dilemmas in the workplace and providing them with the tools and resources they needed to make ethical decisions. He also pledged to donate a portion of his personal wealth to establish a fund dedicated to supporting whistleblowers and promoting ethical behavior within the company. As news of Alexander's actions spread, the mood within Horizon Dynamics began to shift. Employees, inspired by their CEO's leadership and determination, rallied behind the company's renewed commitment to integrity and accountability. Teams collaborated more effectively, communication channels opened up, and a sense of unity and purpose permeated the organization once more. Outside the company, investors and stakeholders took note of Alexander's decisive actions and transparent communication. They recognized that Horizon Dynamics was taking concrete steps to address the issues that had led to the scandal and was committed to rebuilding trust and safeguarding the company's future. In the months that followed, Horizon Dynamics embarked on a journey of transformation and renewal. Under Alexander's leadership, the company emerged from the shadow of scandal stronger and more resilient than ever before. With a renewed focus on integrity, transparency, and ethical conduct, Horizon Dynamics regained its position as a trusted leader in the global business community. As Alexander looked back on the tumultuous events that had tested the company's resilience, he felt a sense of pride and satisfaction.